Hello, my name is Dr. Lane Robson. I'm a pediatrician and a pediatric kidney and bladder specialist. I've been working as a doctor helping families for almost 50 years. Yep, I'm that old. For the last 20 years, I've devoted my practice exclusively to helping families with children who have day and nighttime wedding. When you focus on such a small area for a long time, you'll learn a thing or two. I hope these videos help families that have children with day and nighttime wedding. Thank you. Hello, my name is Dr. Lane Robson. The question that I will answer today is how can I help my child learn to poop in the morning before they go to school? Bedwetting in a child is mostly about a small bladder. And when you poop plays a role in the size of a bladder. The optimal time to poop for a bigger bladder is in the morning before the child goes to school. When a child poops in the morning, before they go to school and the rectum is empty, there's less poop pressure on the bladder and the bladder will be able to hold more. Every time the child pees at school, the child is practicing holding more. But asking a child to poop in the morning isn't enough. There are some rules that I teach the family to apply to encourage their child to learn to poop in the morning. The first rule is there needs to be enough time. If the family, the child is in a rush getting out the door for school, there will not be a morning poop. About a decade ago I did a survey of several hundred families and learned that the average family in my city had about 45 minutes from the time the child woke up until they left for school. That's not enough time. I recommend that the family structure at least one hour from the time the child wakes up until the time the child leaves the home for school. Now if it's an especially busy family, you might need to schedule more time. If you need to get the child up a little earlier, you'll probably need to get the child to bed earlier because the duration of sleep is important. The second principle, rule that I teach, is that the child should be asked to sit on the toilet for 10 minutes by the clock after breakfast every morning even if they don't feel like they need to poop. At the start of this process, the child will not feel like they need to poop and the parent is need, going to need to finesse the cooperation of the child. The next rule is that the parent needs to supervise this process. I call the parent the personal poop trainer mom or personal poop trainer dad. And their supervision is essential if we're going to have a good outcome. Again, it's not, not enough just to ask your child to do this. Supervision looks different for every child. For preschool and early elementary children, I recommend that the mother or the father are actually in the bathroom during the 10-minute sit-on-the-toilet session. Solidarity is important. When the parent is present, the child realizes that this is serious business. I think a lot of children enjoy that special time with the parent. I think the parent should make it an interesting and fun time because lots of children will get bored very quickly. They could read together, talk together, watch a video together. Make this interesting. Finesse the cooperation of the child. The last rule is that the family needs to be patient. Morning poops are not going to happen right away or for several weeks. 
It might take several months for the morning poops to settle in. But it's important the child routinely sit to help build that morning bathroom behavior time. It takes several months sometimes because we can't make the poop super soft super quickly. It takes time to achieve poop soft enough that it will come out every morning. So patience is necessary. So to review, how a parent can teach their child to poop in the morning after breakfast before they go to school, they need to have time, I recommend a minimum of an hour. They need to sit on the toilet after breakfast for 10 minutes every single morning, even if they don't feel like they need to poop. The parent needs to supervise this process. They need to finesse the cooperation by making this an interesting fun time, and the family needs to be patient. Thank you.